taking a look at whether you're scrolling through social media or flipping through a magazine, it's hard not to notice how celebs always have the perfect hair, makeup, and nails. So as part of our new series, The Pros Know, we went straight to the source. We went to the professionals behind the stars, and they are celebrity hair colorist Rita Hazan. She's with us. We've got celebrity manicurist Mr. Tom Bachik. <laughs> and we've got Mally Beauty founder Mally Ronco. <laughs> All right, guys. Okay, Rita, uh -huh. let's start with the hair salon, okay? okay. okay. What, what you're going to do is basically tell us how to get the beautiful things. Glossy, shiny, yes. Yes. gorgeous So hair. when you're at the hair salon, yeah. what should you ask? You should always get a gloss. Oh, what is that for a gloss? A gloss, it, it kind of like brings it all together. Mm -hmm. It balances the whole color, and then at the end, it closes the cuticle, so you have a shiny. Oh. Uh, Did you just color. do a gloss? Because your hair is shiny. Uh, you're, yes, you're I use glossy. actually the, a golden gloss so okay. to keep my hair nice and golden. Okay. So if you if your hair turns brassy, this is a good gloss to use. You could do at home. So you want to get a gloss in the salon, but you want to maintain it maintain at home. It at home. Okay, okay. So you just like a couple of pumps. So it's like a mousse kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, it's so easy. You put it on in the shower, rinse it off right away, shampoo, gloss, condition. Okay, okay. so shampoo, <laughs> gloss, yes. condition. Yes. You don't put this on when your hair's dry and no, blow it out. No, when it's only wet. When it's yes. wet. Okay. Here, only girl. when it's wet. Okay, so exactly. then after so, that, then you blow it out and it's got that shiny glossy feel. It has a shiny gloss and it's okay. never like yellow. It doesn't dip. Okay. Into like a dull color. Okay. okay. Tell us about fake uh, highlights. Okay. Yes, <laughs> easy. We want the shortcut. Okay, shortcut. Fake highlights is every time a lot of people get a lot of highlights, right? Yeah. So in between, so you don't damage your hair, I call them fake highlights. You just put a few around the, your hairline and some around your crown, just so How do you your do hair. It? Fake just show us. Well, With the spray? Just, no, no. You we, at the salon. Oh, you let okay. them do it. It's actual oh. highlight. All right. Now oh. let's do the root okay. fix. That's yes. what you're going to show. This us. is very important. Okay. So this is to maintain your hair color at home. Everybody always Girl, has beautiful. I know, but look you at these. Almost look at this. I know, but to me that's almost zero. Yeah, right. believe me. Right, but okay, this is go, when Irma. you want to. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, Irma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Wait, you want to always look like this. Did I get you? you I just sprayed that face. You Sorry. just paid $300. Yes, exactly. And Sorry. Irma, you're gorgeous. So exactly. that's it. Do you just spray in the part? Spray in the what about part, here? The hairline. Yes, uh -huh. exactly. We all know where it comes. So uh -huh. you just spray the hairline here. And does it wash out? What it happens? It stays put until you shampoo it out. You know, okay. so you have to um, make sure you learn how to spray it. And learn how to wash learn it. Learn how to wash well, it out. You yeah. are your, yeah. Bobby, we love that you're your here. Bobby Thomas' guru <laughs> and, and ours, too. Savannah, so, don't you do Savannah? Savannah? Yeah, she yeah. does. Awesome. Girls. All okay. right, let's move it on. Let's talk manicures, Nail. Tom. Yes. Okay, so you say don't use water. This Don't do water at the... We want our manicures to last longer, right? Yeah. We want them to last longer. Yeah. And in the salon, in a lot of salons... Yes. The soak is like the primary part of the yeah. manicure. The problem is soaking can actually swell the skin and the nails. Oh. So the nails absorb so much water that they can actually even change shape. <gasps> so what should you do? So one thing is by soaking, the cuticles swell. When they go to cut cuticles, they see all the swell and they overcut versus just cutting oh. what is excess. So should you just say, please, no water? Yeah, and let's, let's not soak. Diva. <laughs> diva, like, oh, my God. They're like, oh, fine. Well, okay. Think about no it. water. Nails go back to their original shape, but you're your right. polish is already right. dried, yeah. and okay. so it stresses the polishes. Smart. Okay, okay. what about some tools when we're doing something at home? Yes, yeah, so I recommend for all my clients that they actually have their own set of tools. Oh. Um, to bring with to you. To bring with That's you. That's smart. Because some salons, they do. They do a great job of sterilizing the tools. They even have their own packages, but most do not. So bring your own. Bring your own tools. You you can worry about yeah. like you have the quality. You know what you're bringing. Yes. They always ask about a top coat. Definitely. Yeah, but so you just is it ask top? Them do we need one? a top cut? Top coat? Yes. I I actually recommend two top coats for my clients. Oh. So a thick top coat, if you're doing it at home, a thick top coat for that extra protection and high gloss shine, oh. ready for the red carpet. What about a what about a fast dry situation? But a quick fast. Thin, fast dry top coat for for maintenance. So every two to three days, refresh your manicure, re-strengthen it. Three, I know they chip early, so that they, it helps them from chipping. Helps them from, from chipping, refreshes your shine. So even yep. if you go get a manicure, yeah. keep that at home and give yourself a little spruce. Absolutely. All right, that's so absolutely good. Thank you Thank so you. much. Hello. Hey. Hey. What do we?
we going to do? Okay, all right. So we're talking about a couple of quick things here, how to make your makeup last longer. You say okay. primer. Primer. Okay, even if you're not going to use it every day. If someone's okay. doing your makeup, use primer. Okay. Why? It holds it. Is it grips it. No, this is the spray. This no, is the no. setting spray. Here's this the is the primer. primer. Yeah, okay. so you're going to put that on. You want to put, and you're going to see on little Carly here, we well, did Carly half of her face. Dream. I know, she's perfect, but half whatever. Half with primer, half, half with without. primer, half with not. Right, so you're going to see that on one half of her face, we did it. And especially for the eye makeup, y'all. You better wow. make sure you use primer. On because, your eyelids, too. Yes, oh, yes, so yes. Because it keeps that. it staying longer? Girl, okay. you're smart and pretty. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Can you yes, come back it. every day? I mean, you know, okay. I'm available. Okay. okay. And then you can use a setting spray, all right, after that. Now, let's talk about things you want to take with you, right, yeah. when you're on the run. Because yeah. yeah. I know you guys just stay home all day, right? Yeah. yeah. So we need, like, okay. a, a few things to a throw in our bag. Yeah, Not you don't like, need this is much. if you just want to put on yeah. your, your run perfect face. Yes, yeah. what exactly. Are so I get on my soapbox. You know I hate translucent powder, yes, right? you do. It makes you look 150 yeah. years yeah. old. So old. Every pore, oh, every wrinkle. So, so yeah. what you want to do is use a clear setting balm. Okay. Something like that. Oh, you a balm. Yes. When you're done with your... Yes, when you're done with your makeup, you just take it and you tap it onto your skin. Tap it, girls. Tap it, yes. And then look. pretty. Smart and pretty. Thank you. Um, okay. And then always a good lip. I like, I like a little these. jelly bomb. Look, My girl Laura cute. Geller makes the best jelly okay, bombs. Shiny mm -hmm. and glossy. Oh, like and you that. get a little, oh, we're just going in, guys. Oh, yeah. This is what it's all okay. about. And bring a little bit of concealer just to pop where on you if you're feeling it? like that. Okay, under, here's where we do. Ready, everybody? Like concealer. Just, I don't know how to do it right. Well, you don't have anything I to do, conceal. I do, but what you don't have anything to conceal. You don't. But here, ready, guys? Underneath the eyes like this, right here. A little in between the eyebrows, a little underneath the bottom. Uh -huh. lip. That's the secret. All right, how do you take your makeup off? For the pop. Okay, removal. I believe in removing every night. Yes. Do you both? Yes, ma'am, we do. Thank we you. We say we do. Not always. I always remove no, my makeup. I've... No, no. You see? Sometimes. You have sometimes. never seen me, except that one time in Vegas. <laughs> okay, anyway. <laughs> okay. Um, use an oil. Okay. It'll break everything oil. down. Gotcha. It'll make your skin feel better. Using oil and then use a wash? Yeah, and way, then wash. Thank you to everybody. Okay. Rita, Tom, Mally, you guys, thank you so much. Y'all are the best. Yay! That was our dream team right there.